morning learners! Are you excited for today's lesson? Come and join me in an awesome adventure in music, arts, PE and health. Dahil sa Mapi 8, DC 566, katawan ay lidiglid, kaya halina at patutaw with Mapi 8. Health Aid Quarter to Lesson 5, Newborn Screening, Upgirl Scoring System, Prenatal and Postnatal Care. Lesson's objective, discuss the importance of newborn screening and upgirl scoring system for a newborn, explains the importance of prenatal and postnatal care. Essential newborn care is a comprehensive strategy to improve the health of a newborn through interventions before conception, during pregnancy, soon after birth, and postnatal period. Let's do this activity. Read each statement in each item and choose the correct word or words in the box on what is meant in the statement. Write your answer is in your notebook. Newborn Screening Act of 2004, Public Act 9288 or NBS is a public health program that identifies infants who are affected by certain genetic metabolic infectious diseases. Early identification and timely intervention can lead to major reduction of morbidity, mortality, and associated disabilities in affected infant. According to RA9288, newborn means infant up to 30 days from the time of completing birth. Newborn screening is a simple procedure to find out whether the baby has congenital metabolic disorder. Importance of neonatal care or newborn screening. Most babies with metabolic disorder looks normal at birth. Well before clinical signs and symptoms emerge, metabolic disorders can be detected by NBS. As a result, Treatment should be taken early to prevent complications from untreated condition. When is screening done? It's ideally performed on the 48th or 72nd life hour. It can also be done after birth, however, after 24 hours. Who will collect the samples of newborn screening? This may be collected by one of the following physician, nurse, medical technologist, or a competent midwife. Here's how a newborn screening looks like. What should be done when a baby is tested positive in the NBS? Babies with promising outcome shall immediately refer to a confirmatory test and further specialist in management. What are the disorders tested for newborn screening? First, we have the congenital hypothyroidism or the CH is a partial or total loss of thyroid gland hypothyroidism function that affect infants from birth or congenital. In the picture is an example of a baby with CH. The other one is the congenital adrenal hyperplasia or CHA. It is a group of rare autosomal inherited recessive disorder characterized by deficiency of one of the enzymes required to produce specific behaviors. In the picture is a sample of a baby with CAH. Galactosemia or GAL is a disorder that affects how a simple sugar called galactose is processed by the body. It is the inability to metabolize the milk sugar component galactose.
here are the symptoms of a baby with galactosemia. We have swelling of the brain, not wanting to eat, spitting up or vomiting, jaundice, pressure around the brain, kidney issues, liver failure, and sepsis. Penial ketonuria is a hereditary condition that raises blood levels of a substance called penillaline. Symptoms, a small head size, seizures, developmental delays, intellectual disabilities. Glucose 6-phosphate dehydrogenase deficiency or the G6PD death is a genetic condition that exists in males exclusively. The disease affects primarily the red blood cells. Apgar scoring system is a test given to a newborn right after birth. Apgar means A for appearance, skin color, P pulse or heart rate, G grimace or reflex response, A for activity or muscle tone, R for respiration or the breathing rate. Here is a copy on how to score Apgar for newborn babies. Rate the infant 0 if he is pale or blue in appearance, 1 point if he is pink body, blue extremities, and 2 points if he is completely pink. For pulse or heart rate, score them 0 point if absent, 1 point if 100 beats per minute, and 2 points if over 100 beats per minute. For respiration, score them 0 if absent, 1 point if slow and irregular, and 2 points for vigorous cry. Grime 0 for flaccid, 1 point for sun flexion, and 2 points for active motion. Activity 0 for absent, 1 for arms and legs flexed, and 2 for active movement. What does the score mean? The test result is in good health if a baby scores 7 or above. A lower score doesn't mean that your baby is unhealthy. It means that your baby may need some immediate medical care such as sanctioning of the airways or oxygen to help him or her breathe better. When to check the UPGAR score, it should be the first minute and then second checking is after 5 minutes. And here is our asynchronous task, HQ2L5 UPGAR scoring. Compute the UPGAR score of the situation on the box. Check the score in the table according to the findings in the situation given. Read and analyze, copy and answer in your notebook, then send an image file in our Google Classroom. And that would be all for today. Thank you for listening. See you again for the next adventure in music, art, PE, and health aid.